Yeah, good morning, Patrice. Well, our calls to Marilyn Mosby's office have not been returned at this hour, but her husband, uh, Delegate Nick Mosby, has responded to us in a statement. I want to show you. It reads in part, quote, I have been in ongoing conversations with the IRS for five years about the tax consequences of an early withdrawal from my retirement savings plan, which I did to support unplanned expenses after a series of family tragedies. It goes on to say that I expect to have the issue resolved in the coming days, end quote. Now, all this comes as the IRS says state's attorney Marilyn Mosby and her husband, state delegate Nick Mosby, owe three years worth of taxes starting all the way back in 2014. Federal documents show that the IRS has now placed a lien on their property and is demanding that the couple pay up. A lien is a claim on property put in place to satisfy a debt. Giovanni Patterson, who is Nick Mosby's opponent in the upcoming city council president's race, calls the failure to pay taxes nothing short of incompetence. Marilyn and Nick Mosby are the 2020 Bonnie and Clyde, um, where, you know, instead of robbing trains, they're actually robbing from the people that they're supposed to serve. Now, a tax attorney who's not connected with this case that we spoke to says in most cases, the IRS gives property owners several opportunities to pay before placing a lien on their property. But once a lien is in place, they say it's rarely ever removed until it's paid in full. Reporting live this morning from City Hall, I'm Elijah Westbrook, Fox 45, Early Edition.